Hi, I'm Jean Shipman, the Eccles Health Sciences Library Director at University of Utah. And before I get started, David did say this was interactive. So if you've ever given a word of advice, please stand up. Okay, congratulations, you're mentors. So. <laughs> and keep standing. If you've ever taken advice given to you by others, have sit down. <laughs> Okay, you're a mentee. So now that we know our roles, um, obviously everyone is a mentor at some point in their life and everyone's a mentee at some point in their life. And I'm here, I'm 36 years into the profession of medical librarianship. Unlike uh, David, I knew exactly what I wanted to do because I wanted to get out of a small town in Pennsylvania and medical librarianship was a way to do that. So my friend and I stormed every night about how we were gonna get out and we, um, I went through all the professional activities I knew of, which was library science from my mom and pharmacy from my sister, put the two together and said, whoa, health library, okay, and a big city, yay, I can get out of Dodge. So 37 years later, uh, nine jobs later, and six institutions later. And all along, I think my success has been given to people who have taken time to take a um, moment to sit with me and talk to me about my efforts, my druthers, my wishes, and in return, I hope I've done the same. So I'm gonna represent medical libraries and there's just a ton of opportunities for mentorship in our field and libraries in general. And I think um, we're known as our sharing, is our culture within our profession. And I guess mentoring just comes naturally. But there is a life cycle and I think from education through retirement, through um, opportunities, you can be a mentor and a mentee. And from education viewpoints, we get advisors who help guide us through the educational process. And then when we get to the job search, there's all kinds of opportunities through our professional associations. There's job fairs, there are career uh, review, resume review opportunities. There's also job placements a lot of times at conferences as well as websites that encourage you how to apply for a job and how to interview. Then during employment, lately I've been noticing that you do get a formal mentor assigned. Um, every time we hire faculty at the university, we have to indicate the mentor for that person. And then it goes a lot of faculty affair offices, have a lot of um, workshops for how to develop your career as well as how to help others. And that's true with HR programs as well. And then I guess, I. I'm sure it's true for every profession, but in the library, our professional organizations are key. They do a lot of educational programs, which I find you know, mentoring and professional development has a very fine line of uh, delineation. But we do a lot with helping each other to work with um, committee work. I mean, what, what's a better thing than to become a leader through actual practice? And I think all of us in this SSP world feel that same way. And OZLD is our Association of Academic Health Science Library Directors, and also the National Library of Medicine do a lot with leadership programs. We do new director program for a year where their mentee and mentors are formally established and do a lot of webinars and conversations about how to be a director. And then new directors have a symposium where people come and speak about different aspects of library. SLA, the Special Library Association, does the same thing as does the ALA, the American Library Association. So as you're employed, then you can think about retirement and um, then you probably can really give back a lot of the knowledge that's been shared with you as well as what you've gained along the way. And that can be, again, through formal mentoring programs or through blogs, through contributing publications and books and um, life doesn't stop with just having a job. But I think the key thing that I've learned um, and why I joined SSP really was to go to other conferences and, and be out there and, and learn from others. And I can remember my first meeting of SSP sitting there and listening to meta tags. And I'm listening, I'm listening, going, you know what? That's library cataloging in a whole different word. But I love your words a lot better. So, um, you know, then I learned about monetization. And I was like, whoa, this is really good. So it's just kind of fun to hear that, you know, we're all working in the same fields, but to hear different perspectives from different viewpoints has just been really great for a mentoring experience. Experience. So I want to leave you and encourage you to mentor often, take advice from others, give it, but also remember to give back. And that's, I think, the value that we give to each other in a field. Thank you. <laughs>